Hey you guys, I hope that you're having a good day today. I just wanted to come on here and say that I have disabled all the comments on all of my videos and the ones going forward, not because I wanna have strife with my brothers and sisters in the body, but because I wanna eliminate the enemy and the distractions. Because I'm trying to make sure that we stay focused on Yahua, okay? And what the Ruach HaKadosh is saying as far as his, what his spirit is saying. And I think that people are um, getting caught up in other things versus focusing on what matters. And that's us trying to gain wisdom and understanding and knowledge and to help strengthen each other and to bring unity and um, wisdom and knowledge and understanding in the body, the church. We are the church, okay? And so I think that the enemy is so crafty. He knows how to come in and cause strife and distractions and to, you know, to try to cause confusion at that. And I don't even watch TV at home, friends. You know, I don't even allow a lot of different things to come into my spirit because I understand that all it takes is one seed to be planted. And depending on what seeds you're allowing through your ear gates and your eye gates, it can start to bear, you know, roots that don't need to really be planted in the first place, if you understand what I'm saying. So I would rather for my seeds to fall on solid ground and bear good fruit in that person's spirit versus you know planting all these other seeds that are meant to be a distraction and to in in a cause um people to turn away from a message that really may actually be a seed that needed to be planted whether they realize that or not and that goes both ways however if people want to send me an email okay with edifying information, books, um, their wisdom and knowledge. I, I welcome that because I don't know everything. But um, just to cut down on that, uh, strife, distractions, confusion, I am going to disable the, um, the, the comments because of that reason. Um, it doesn't mean I don't want to hear you guys' voice. Because I really do, you know, I don't need to be validated in the comments. So I'm taking that off of there too, okay? Because this is not about me, okay? It's about me trying to do the will of my father and trying to make him proud of what he's asked me to do and steward that properly, okay? So that should be the focus at this point. There are two or three other people that I would um, recommend watching the Davis ministry. Oh my gosh, I found him recently led by the Ruach and he confirms so much stuff even for me and even edifies, you know, me with new knowledge and wisdom or seeds that have been planted, but he's, you know, helping get to grow and bring connections. I really love his word. Um, he's, he's, he tells the truth. He has the meat. There's some people right now that are still a babe on their walk on breast milk and there's some people that need a little bit more meat okay and so um he has some meat over there i think monica d i don't haven't watched all of her stuff she may have some stuff you know out here as well um to help edify and grow those in the body and i think it's mira waiters or waters um she has um, videos out here too now their videos are long i wish i can have you know sit here for hours at a time and I would have to break that up. And so I would really point you in their direction too, because they have, you know, spent a little bit longer time putting it together on videos, things that I wish I could sit here and do and have the same revelation actually to give you guys. And, and some of it I don't because I'm still, you know, getting that impartation, you know, from sitting with the father, Abba father myself. And so I know that, um, Yahua is giving wisdom and understanding. He keeps leading me to 1 Kings 2 and in, in section 3 um, through 4, where it talks about how he gave, you know, Solomon all this wisdom and knowledge and under, um, understanding because that's all, all, all that he asked for. And he was saying, shall you then give to your servant an understanding heart to rule your people, to discern between good and evil for who is able to rule this great people of yours? And so he actually gave the Elohim actually gave him um he said because you asked for the you know for that and have not asked for your life for yourself or you know even for riches for yourself or nor have you asked the life of your enemies but have asked for your discernment to understand the right ruling um he gave him you know he gave him all this wisdom and understanding 
You, you know what I'm saying? By the Ruach HaKadosh. So he keeps leading me there. And so I want to focus on that and keep our eyes fixed on Yahuwah at this time. Um, I apologize also to anybody for any misunderstandings and any hurt feelings behind anything. But I also want you guys to know I didn't, I'm not out here to people please. Um, I'm not out here for opinions. I'm not out here for an audience of validation, okay, because I don't need people to validate me. What I need is real edification in the body. Um, and so I didn't disable comments because um, there may be a disagreement. I disabled them and deleted them because it's a distraction. And also, I just felt as though if I delete this one over here, then people are going to say that, oh, I don't want their comments to be seen, but only comments that, you know, are either confirming or agreeing. And so to eliminate that, I disabled everybody's comments. Okay. Um, so I hope that, um, you guys, you know, stay for those who want to, uh, continue. That's fine. You know, I just ask that your Ua brings the people that really want to hear and can hear and the people that want to see can't and can see. OK, and that whatever seeds that I plant, OK, that they fall on good soil, OK, and that they bear good fruit and that is rooted and helps them to become rooted in Yahushua HaMashiach. So you're staying solely dependent on him anyway. OK, so I hope that you guys understand that. I love you all. I come out here in love. I don't know if I said it already, but people pleasing is a form of idolatry and I'm not going to value the opinions of man over what Yahuwah has asked me to do, okay? So please understand that and understand that truth, it may sound harsh to some people, but you have to give the truth whether it sounds harsh to people or not, okay? And that's, that's, that's to help convict, not condemn. That's not my job like I stated before. So if anybody felt condemned, I apologize for that. That's not where my heart space is. And the Father, Abba Father, Yahuwah, he knows where my heart is, all right? So if y'all can't see that, I apologize. But if you was in my presence, you might see something, you know, see it a little bit differently because this is video and these are uh, texts, you know what I'm saying? And it's hard to read tones and where people are coming from, you know, when you're reading stuff, you know? And that that's how technology can cause so much confusion and strife and the enemy knows how to twist it, right? So anyway, I love you all. You have a good day and I will talk to you guys soon.